separate across the blades of glowing gold. I see you the same. Quite simply, it doesn't get any more pressure packed than this. The decisive game at the Euros with everything on the line. Which country will be crowned champions of Europe? It's going to be fascinating finding out. This is EA TV. And this is the game we've all been waiting for. The final itself here at the 2024 UEFA European Championship. I'm Derek Ray, sitting high above the halfway line. And next to me, ready to provide expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. This should be fiercely contested. It's Spain against England. Now, will the cross work out for them? A decisive clearance it was. Here's the lineup for Spain. Fabian plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And the main striker today is Morata. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and what a great finish it is. Struck with power and accuracy, certainly no stopping that. And England get us moving again. A quick response required after the setback. Declan Rice. And he read it well. Alexander Arnold. Spain recovering possession well. Feeding it through. Oh, but brilliantly read to cut it out. It looks so promising. Jordan Pickford. chance to play it in and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end sends it back Foden well timed tackle Alexander Arnold Disappointing for England to give it away in that manner. And threading it through. Well, it looked like it might lead to something very positive indeed, but a useful interception. Declan Rice. And with Bellingham. Just the challenge that was required. And showing the importance of wit. Morata. He's got to score! Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Room to roam on the wing for England. Alexander Arnold. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Fabian. A long way from the perfect pass. Kane. This could square the game, but the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. 
Laporte. Kukureya. Clean challenge. Alexander Arnold. And will it be the leveller? And the keeper there to deal with it. Going short. Mark Duehi. Kane. Kane. Who had no intention of losing out. An England corner as they look to get back into this game. And the short option preferred. Well, pressure building. Another corner. <laughs> Elects to go short. Difficult to stop him. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Kukureya. Can they create something from here? Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Bellingham. Now Harry Kane. Rice, and on to Bellingham, an unforced error you've got to say, and really discomfited by the press, Morata, Kukureya. And quick thinking defensively. Good looking sequence. Oh, how about that for the last line of defense? Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. And we will have just one additional minute. Trippier. And there it is, the half-time whistle. And back underway here, with England looking to find a route back into the game. Fabian. In position. Oh, he saved it well. Yet another tremendous save to add to the list. Bellingham 
Declan Rice. Phil Foden now. Trippier. And options in the centre. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Really poor timing and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, he can't believe that decision. He's not happy at all, is he? Well, that didn't go exactly to plan. And no wonder he's getting a few icy stares from his teammates. Yeah, that's a complete waste. He was never going to score from there. Pedri. Here's Carvajal. Pedri. He's enjoying space. Just cutting off the supply. Trent Alexander-Arnold. Went in strongly to win the ball. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Oh, surely! No way through! Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. <laughs> Who can they pick out? Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. And he's fired over the corner. Well, that was quality. Last ditch defending. And the referee blows for a foul. Rice with it. Now he's allowed it to go over the touchline, so a throw in. Well, England have controlled possession, as you can see, but they aren't doing enough with it. They need to pass it quicker, play forward earlier, and show more energy. Otherwise, they won't get back into this one. Well, attacking possibilities. Shot attempted. Oh, good work by the keeper. Well, that save could be the turning point here because they've been second best all over the pitch up to now. Well, it was a splendid piece of goalkeeping, but he has to remain on his toes. Well, possession lost by Spain. Breaking at pace. Foul there, free kick awarded. And Bellingham. 
He read the situation. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, that is how to strike a free kick and that's how to make a save. Well, as you can see, it wasn't even close, was it? No debate about that one. So the corner played into the box and he did so well to move across and deal with the danger well they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner oh disappointing clearance Saka Trippier John Stones and on to Bellingham chance maybe oh it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee and maybe they'll be able to level this up well he's also showing him the yellow card yeah he had to make the challenge but it was always going to be risky and so it proved well I think it's fair to say he doesn't agree with that decision And now to level the game. And slot it home. Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't show it. A goal from the spot. Let's take another look. He deceives the goalkeeper really well here by getting to dive one way before placing it into the opposite side. A really good penalty. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Determined defending. Pressing really high. Walker. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Alexander-Arnold. Ten minutes to go. All even, but will it stay that way? Well, it came to nothing in the end. This looks promising. And teammates to play it to. Can he put it away? And that miss might come back to haunt them. Well, what a chance to win the game. He just lacked composure, didn't he? Walker. Now Harry Kane. He's showing a real will to win the ball. And threading it through. Well, he really is a good goalkeeper in those situations. He's just kept his team in it here. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, a bit short with the clearance. Head to be. Now, looking dangerous here. Misfiring completely. Yeah, he's gone for power, but the contact was never right. It's a poor effort, really. Morata is up there. Blocking it. Fabian denied once more. Disappointing pass. Well, the action is going to continue for a while yet. We will have four minutes of stoppage time. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. And played in. Oh, a goal! Late drama here! And surely that's one hand on the trophy. So little time left for a response now. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Well, plenty of scope for them to attack. 
Delivering it into the box. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. And there goes the final whistle. England have won the Euros on this dramatic night here in Berlin. The joy, the ecstasy, also the disappointment, but ultimately the feeling of togetherness. Well, I have to say, they've been brilliant throughout the tournament. They were great today as well. They are the deserved champions, no doubt about that. And these are very special scenes that we're witnessing. And now, with the pressure off, a chance to reflect, a chance to celebrate, the trophy about to be presented. The European champions, England! What a great moment for these players. Absolutely brilliant. doesn't get any better than this does it a chance now to celebrate with their own fans and the fans have also played their part just listen to the noise here great end to this tournament